and gentlemen, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die Alpha 16 Build 119. This is the third episode in our series. All right, brand new Let's Play. So let me run through really quick um, what I did overnight. I spent some points and spent them on Run Forest Run. Uh, weapon and tool smithing. So you'll see that my tools are up a level. I looted the rest of this house. I moved the stuff from the cupboards in the kitchen upstairs and let's get going. I reckon it is time to start um, going through and searching and looting. Let's see what we can get up to. Now, sometimes these little garages, I think a lot of people overlook, and sometimes they're pretty good to us. Yeah, take it like a boss. There you go. Now I can't shoot you in the head. I don't want to wake the, her friend up. There we go. I did eat and drink overnight as well. How'd you like that, lady? I don't know where you're going. I'm going to stand on the garbage and hide your head. There we go. That's going to work. Looks like this could be a bit interesting. I think she's dead. Let's find out. Hope she's dead. She's a tough cookie. As you saw in the last episode. Hopefully she's guarding some pretty good loot in here. Yeah. See a bottle. Oh, another axe and a potato seed. Those potato seeds can be rare. It took me ever so long in my uh, multiplayer server world. Ooh, mushroom seed too. To get the potatoes growing in the garden properly. A little look-see around. Alright, well, hopefully this one is a little better. Not saying the last one was horrible by any means. Uh, we have a sleeping cheerleader. Oh yes, I was able to do the iron reinforced club as well. Die, lady. Oh! Oh! You're not who I wanted to see in here. You're not who I wanted to see. Riata. Uh huh. Why do you always talk about Riata? There. How do you like that? The old jump and slap on top of the noggin technique. Now, as always, keep an eye on your stamina when you're doing melee. Because if you run out, boy, you're you're in trouble. Like I said, she is a tough cookie. Woo. Put that big old booty away, lady. Alright, what'd the cheerleader have? Yeah, more shorts. We, oh, I also um, found on the map the trader. More water. We need that. We are going to need that. So, in a upcoming episode, we will be heading to the trader. I think what I want to do before I get too heavy duty is go ahead and make another storage box. Actually, let's make. Yeah, let's go ahead and make them all. Oh, I made a bone shiv. I chopped up the zombies and was able to make a bone shiv. Let's go ahead and put one right here on the side of the house. And let's just dump everything we aren't going to need for our little adventure. And then we'll have more room. I did make a splint as well. And I have that leather duster just in case we get a bit chilly. Because like I said, you're either hot or you're cold in this game. 
glass I'm not going to worry about right now. Let's break into this house. Let's use our good axe. And we'll probably do this house and then look for something more commercial. Hopefully for better loot purposes. And I'm just going to hit the high value targets. I don't see a need to go through and uh, chop everything out. I can come back at night. Oh boy. The old spinorama move, huh? Didn't your mom tell you it's not polite to walk on the furniture? Yeah, right in the junk. How'd that feel? He didn't mind. Well, maybe he didn't mind. I don't know. You can ask him. And boom. That was a fail. Can't wait until I get a better bow. Alright, he has a friend that's going to wake up now. Ooh, bird's ass. Let's go ahead and grab those. Ah. It's another one of the mom. Oh, are you serious? You're going to sneak up. That's what I meant by the zombs are way sneakier. They're derpy, but they're way sneakier. They will sneak up behind you and slap you when you're not looking. Alright. Well, that's a thing. How'd that feel? In the neck. Okay, there's an arrow glitch too. Sometimes your arrows seem to go right through them. And the other guy despawned for whatever reason. There we go. Probably more baddies in here. More water. We need that. Better pants is always good. Okay. Should not take 10 chops to do away with garbage on the floor. I did that because it does make noise and it can wake them up. There we have a cooking pot, so that's good. Tin cans, why not? Doors locked. Let's see, that is 200. That is 300. Oh, we're going to get a friend open it for us here, so we'll let him do a little bit of the work, or he or she. Just let them work on that for a minute. I loot everything out here? I have. Yeah, might have to help them out. Ooh, that hurt her. Ooh, there's a couple in there. It's afraid of that. Let's let them bust out. Hello, ladies. Good morning, and welcome to my channel. You didn't know you'd be a famous YouTube star someday, did you? Ooh, swing and a miss, lady. Good thing, because you had me backed in the corner. She had a regular bandage. She'll have shorts and trainers for my, U, uh, I almost said my UP friends. <laughs> UP is Upper Peninsula of Michigan. What I meant to say, European friends, they call them trainers. Yeah. There. Yeah, fertilizer. Take that. That's always good. More stuff for the... Did I get that trash? I did. More stuff for the trader. Toilet guns. I've been finding more assembled guns in Alpha 16 than ever before. Ooh, we can use that. Now I know why there were a couple of girls in here guarding because um, those med kits are rare. And give me a good one. Nothing. Alright, I can come back later and knock down the curtains and get everything. I think so. Yep. And uh, chop everything up and get more goodies out of there if needed. 
uh, they will, the baddies will respawn, so keep that in mind, guys. Uh, don't think because you've cleared something that um, you're safe, because you're probably not. Uh, regular bandage. Hmm. Yeah, I'll put that in there temporarily, and let's make more arrows. Always... A, B, C. I always be crafting, guys. I guess I should do all of them. There we go. Alright, let's head over in this commercial area and look for a little higher value targets. Yeah, a random dead zombie. I don't remember killing a zombie over here. Ooh, a cornfield. Oh, very good. Very good indeed. Yeah, yeah, why not? I always use wood. Okay, that's a diner. Um, what is that? Is that a diner? A double diner? Side by side? I'll probably skip more fertilizer. Holy cow. She's taking a nap right there. Let's just do away with her really quickly. One less zombie to fight later. We'll hit up a few cars and we'll still look for something a little more high value. I think what I'll do, guys, is pause out and um, pick it up again when we get a little more exciting. Okay, guys, we're back. Looks like we've got a working stiffy tool. And a ton, an absolute ton. What is this? Big Harrison's Pond and Loan. Hmm, I've never done a pawn shop. There are absolute tons of burger places and diners in this town. That is a real thing. Um, let's do the pawn shop just because I have never done a pawn shop. Ooh, some beer. Um, if you start hitting the vending machines, you get an electric shock. It's unlocked. Okay, that was a bit weird. There should be some baddies. Let's go ahead and close that behind us. Oh boy. Yep. I uh, can't get up there. I want a different weapon because we're in melee time. Oh boy, they're all coming right out of the ceiling. Ooh, I knew he was going to get me. Should drink that beer before I die and I'm stunned like a big... Big dog. Hopefully there's not too many baddies. Ooh. Let's take care of him. I've never had them drop out of the ceiling before. Ooh, I may get wrecked. Ooh. I get forage in here. Oh. Oh, it's not looking good. Ah. Oh. Got wrecked. <sighs> okay, guys. Well, let's spawn back in and boogie boogie run over there and get our stuff. Holy smokes. Glad I'm not playing one death. Okay, spawning back in. Alright, well, we're pretty close to our backpack. Uh, I have it just drop backpack on death. So, good thing we weren't playing single death. That would have been a short one. Yeah, I see you. Well, you get a little tour of the town as I'm running back. We have a booby trap. Clearly marked girls. <laughs> oh, yes. So, the pawn shop's no joke, guys. Uh... Be a little more prepared than I was to go in there. 
There's a backpack that I didn't see on the way over. Hopefully it don't. Ooh, hunting knife. Nice. Yeah, be a little more prepared than I was. That's my 10 cent advice. Mm -hmm, pardon me. Goodness. I thought I was clever by closing that door and I probably should have kited them all outside and I would have had a little better time uh, dealing with them. Don't follow me all the way over there. Oh yes, uh, another thing is wandering hordes. We seem to be um, getting a ton of wandering hordes on the server. so. What are the chances this back door is going to be unlocked? It's not. Alright, so let's regain our stamina. We shouldn't have anything but that knife. Because we're going to want a little stamina to deal with these guys. I wonder if I should take care of him so he doesn't get involved. Go to sleep now. Yeah, yeah, it's some paper. Looks like decent loot in here. Let's see if we can kite them outside and get our backpack back. And Ooh, they've gone back to sleep. Weird. Let's get him outside anyway. Oh, I only have the one arrow. Bullocks. Um... Hmm. We're going to get 20 guys dropping out of the ceiling. Let's run back and get in here. We just have her, I think. Go to sleep now, lady. Ooh, she had some food. Alright, we have him. No arrows. Let's try to sneak. Or, is that a her? And yeah, that's a him. That's a cowboy zone. Reload our bow. Alright. Whew! Nice that there's a forge here. I don't think I can pick it up. Oh. Okay, it's not a... It's a destroyed forge. Alright. So what I got out of it was whatever was in it. So that's interesting. That'll be the new jail cell door. See if there are no zombs in the stalls. Seeing any. Hear a bit of crashing and banging. Toilet gun? Toilet water? Ooh. Alright. It's a little close quarters for that. Why you gotta hit me and stun me? Constant stunning. The I don't like the I'm not a fan of the stun effect. I'm just not. It's a bit of a bother. Well, I suppose it's meant to be. Seems like it's pretty good loot in here. Parts. The new traps are sweet, guys. The new traps are completely sweet. Or funky water. Anything back there? No. 
Wouldn't mind a toilet gun. Turds I'm not into. You guys can keep your turds. Alright. Well, let's see what we can do here. Let's get a bow out. I hear somebody caterwauling. going to be a bit hard to break into. Let's see if we can get some more beers and stuff. Water for sure. Ah, yes. Um, scrap that. Take that. Alright, that's trash up there. Oop. There's a baddie. Let's see if we can just take him out. Should be getting a sneak bonus. We are. I think he's dead. Let's see if there's any more. Oh yeah, right there's a dude. He's starting to wake up. Starting to flop around. Nice. Yeah, baby. Like a boss. Let's do the sneak damage again. We're not getting a headshot. One more and he should be done. Not giving me a very big target, is he? There we go. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, there's a baddie back in that cage. We'll leave him right back there. He should be dead. Being cautious and going slow here, guys. I'm sure there are more baddies up in the upstairs bit. Alright, let's continue on looting. Alright, apparently we're going to need a drop chest. Still looking for a water source is why I brought all my empties with me. It's probably going to be a good spot for a drop chest as, ooh, Wandering Horde. Let's just leave those guys alone. Um, get rid of everything here. Except for feathers and a med kit. Let's keep that on us. That, murky water, which we'll want to take home. Eggs can stay. Alright. Alright. Let's get after this thing. Looks like our timer's about to go off, but I'm going to do some editing on here, so we'll go a bit long. Let's see what's in the crates, shall we? I think we only have one more baddie, and he's in the cage back there. Oh! The heck, you don't... Maybe that just meant it was empty? Because I can't search it. Weird. Okay. Eh. That's the new thing, too, is you get, um... Oh, no, there was a toilet in it. Let's see if we can jump up here. Alright, zombies can get up there, but we can't. Murky water. Random cash register. Alright, hush timer. Oh, businessman, he must be the owner. Hello, sir. Yes, I like your establishment. It's very nice. You're not doing good business because you broke. Alright. Gonna be some stuff I'm afraid we won't. Oh, paintbrush and more fertilizer. It's good loot. Gonna be some stuff I don't think we're gonna be able to break into, like those cages. They're pretty heavy duty. This one we should be able to come in. I think there's a baddie in here. Uh, maybe not. Okay. 
thought there was a baddie in this cage, but this would make an excellent jail. Yeah, a few gun parts, good enough. Ooh, another toilet. More murky water. Boy, I'll take it. Alright, a uh, cooking pot we can take. Oh yeah, you're stuck in there, but I'm not letting you out. Vending machine that we've hit. You, I'm going to leave you in there too. If you want to break it out for me, good enough. Oh, somebody snuck up behind me. It's a construction worker zombie. A lot of times they have some good loot. I found dynamite on them. And mini bike parts. Ooh, you lost your head, sir. Make sure to edit that out. Okay guys, we are back and still looting like mad. We're going to finish this up and then we're going to book back to the house. Our temporary base. These chairs we want to pick up because we can scrap them for wood. We're going to have to get up there in the ceiling and check that out as well. Toilet. Boy, those are popular at the pawn shop. Or water. I'll take it. Okay, that one's open. Alright, some of this stuff we're just not going to be able to uh, do a lot with right now because we just don't quite have the tools. I'm going to check check the hit points on them, but I think they're really quite high. Oh, he's done. Yeah, let's check these cages. 8,000? I don't really think so. I see you. I wondered if you were alive. Well, technically, are you alive? <laughs> ah, he had a little lint in his pocket. Nice. This looks like a little hardcore parkour here to get up there in the roof. Yeah, you guys are going to be mad if we don't go check that out. Oh, this stuff just breaks as you walk over it, too. Woo. Whoa! Yeah, it's uh, pretty tough going up there, it looks like. I don't know how the zombies are able to walk around on it, but they are. Alright guys, I'm going to head back to the house and... Wait a minute. That's locked. Okay. And we will call this a somewhat promising... Uh, ooh, let's finish breaking that. Uh, episode and yeah we'll let the zombies break this all apart for us well you know that isn't bad there probably open this up let some more baddies out I've always wished when you bust through a frame like that, then you could just go ahead and pick it up. Probably going to get hit in my back because there's two of them in there. Alright, he's done. I guess he's the only one in here. Let's, oh no. 
more stunning. For cheerleader, you hit pretty hard, lady. There we go. Alright, let's repair this. And open these last couple of crates, and then we will call it an episode. Nice. Whew. It's been a pretty exciting episode, I think. Wow, a whole shotgun and an AK part. Not horrible. Mm. Let's see, we have a cooking pot. Let's go ahead and scrap that in exchange for mechanical parts. Yes, please. All right, guys. That's going to wrap it up for this episode. I'm going to grab a few things out of this drop chest. Like the water. All the murky water. And uh, run back to the house. And uh, we'll pick it up there for episode number four. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Um, I will let you guys know that all three of these episodes will all be back to back recorded. So comments, questions, concerns uh, will be ignored until episode number four. I always read my comments. I always uh, respond to them. So please feel free to talk to me that way. Also, you can join my Discord. Uh, should be links down in the description if you want to hang out. Uh, if you have suggestions, that's a great place to come in and leave them as well. That was weird. It's kind of raining over there and sunning over here. Uh, scrap that and I'll just wear that to get rid of it and we'll pick that shirt up. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like, share, and subscribe if you're new to the channel and all that fun stuff. And I will catch you next time. And be safe out there in the real world.